I'm Kevin Cobb, Product Marketing Manager for the Challenger Combine. I'd like to welcome you to the iConnect show today. Uh, at the show, we are introducing a uh, concept vehicle of our combine baler combination that is used to harvest uh, not only corn or soybeans or other crops, but also to harvest and collect the biomass products that uh, may be available for opportunities such as ethanol production, heat production, and other uh, livestock purposes. Today the, uh, the combine we have on display is actually the Class 7 670B combine. This is a 350 horse combine uh, that has been modified to tow the baler in both the drive system but also the discharge system of the uh, chopper areas is modified to uh, actually deliver the product in a simple manner without conveyors and chains and so on into the baler. On staff today is Dean Morrell. Dean is the product marketing manager for the hay products and I'll have him discuss what we've done on the baler area to make this connection work. Thanks Kevin. Tell you what we've ended up doing, and that's that we transfer the uh, the crop from the combine. If you look here, there's a big gap between the the combine and the baler assembly. Now we've taken this thing and we've uh, done some modifications to the combine, also the throat of the baler to deliver this crop or mog material back into the baler. And the modification we've done to a standard baler. Remember, this is a standard baler, and we've done some modifications to it. Some of these modifications that we've been able to do to the combine and the baler is through a DOE grant that we've been able to uh, collect. But through these changes here, we've taken our standard baler, we've made some modifications to be able to, to produce this mog bale. And the main benefit of this mog bale, and that is going into transportation, okay? We were able to transport this bale. It's a three by four square bale. We transport it, load it on trucks, move it out of the field, move it to the biorefineries. With this, we can do that very efficiently with the square bale. And going through the field, we have this hook to the baler, the baler hook to the combine. We can go through and we can monitor, still monitor everything we have behind us with the baler. The bale's coming out, the, the uh, flakes of the bale, to be able to produce this mog bale. But one more good feature, it's not just for ethanol that we're using this for. This now we can use it for guys that have their own cattle farms, other operations for cattle farmers, and other uses. We're producing a clean mog bale, and that is about 75% cobs, 25% material other than leaves. We want to thank you today for being here to look at this concept that we're having from ATCO. Thanks.